In August 2010, a police officer in Sugar Creek was responding to a report of a tire on the highway when he witnessed the car speeding past him, veering off the road, and crashing into an overpass. The officer and several other witnesses rushed to help and found the driver seriously injured. The driver was taken to the hospital and eventually recovered from the accident. An investigation later revealed that the driver had lost control of the car due to a mechanical problem. While no one else was injured, the incident left an impact on the witnesses who now take extra precautions while driving in their neighborhood. A disturbing incident occurred on Thornley Road where an unknown woman and her father were driving when they saw a strange shape on the road. As they got closer, they realized that it was a human figure and upon closer inspection, they saw that it was a teenage boy. The boy suddenly stood up and started approaching their vehicle. The woman urged her father to drive away, but the boy approached her window before they could leave. This situation could have ended differently if they had stopped to help the boy. The individual's intentions for doing this is unclear. This video was captured in Medellin. It shows a group of bikers who can be seen carefully planning their target at a red light. The uploader mentioned that the bikers even seemed to consider the car with a dash cam as a potential target before eventually deciding to pursue the car in front. As the targeted car slowed down, one of the bikers made sure to keep a considerable distance between it and the other vehicles, including the dash cam car and the adjacent lane. The bikers then approached the car during a traffic stop, and after attempting to rob the occupants, took some of their items and left the scene. One of the bikers can be seen trying to cover his license plate with his leg, but their actions were caught on the dash cam. It's unclear whether the individuals were ultimately arrested or not. The video depicts two cars in Bedford View, South Africa, collaborating on the road to commit robbery against other drivers. One of the vehicles is a white Volkswagen van, while the other is a dark-colored car. Their plan involves blocking traffic and using weapons to intimidate and steal from unsuspecting drivers. The dash cam footage captures the moment when three armed men from the first car step out to rob the driver behind them, who is recording the incident. The thieves then flee after presumably obtaining the desired belongings. The second car can be seen serving as a blockade to facilitate the escape of the bandits. It's unknown what happened after this. This footage was captured on a dark and isolated road. Initially, everything seemed ordinary until the car turned a bend and an odd figure, dressed in a suit and carrying an umbrella and a briefcase, appeared on the screen. Shortly after, another identical figure was seen. Both figures quickly retreated into the tall grass, where multiple identical men were hiding. They appeared to have been startled by the vehicle, as if they were caught off guard. As the car continued down the road, yet another figure holding a flare came into view. However, it remains unclear what happened after that and what the driver truly witnessed that night. On February 15, 2013, people living in the Urals region of Russia were surprised when they witnessed a bright object descending from the sky, which illuminated the area so intensely that it appeared as a second sun, causing temporary blindness in some areas. This object was a meteor that exploded in the Earth's atmosphere, creating shockwaves that caused damage to buildings and broke windows several miles away. A factory in the area was destroyed beyond repair due to the impact. Although there were reports of some injuries, they were mostly minor, including debris-related injuries and eye strain. 
scientists immediately searched for the crater created by the meteor's debris and eventually found a six-meter hole in the ice on Lake Chabakul. The impact site was confirmed after several meteorite specimens were recovered from the water and surrounding area. Several dashcams captured this. In this video, a married couple who were on a vacation, rented a motorbike and headed back to their resort at 10 p.m. after spending the day in a nearby city. However, they realized that they had missed their exit after traveling for about 10 miles. Despite the late hour, they decided to continue on their current path in the hope of reaching a main road. As they progressed, they noticed a woman dressed entirely in white standing on the roadside, and they were far away from any sign of civilization. As the couple sped past the woman on the deserted road late at night, she didn't seem to react. The incident occurred in a remote area, miles away from any nearby towns or cities, at around 10 p.m., and the identity of the woman and the reason for her presence on the road remain a mystery. This dashcam footage was captured in Russia on October 29, 2013. It shows a truck carrying a shipment through a pitch-black road lit up solely by its headlights. Suddenly, a tree falls right in front of the truck, only becoming visible when it appears in the headlights. The falling tree landed just a few feet from its trunk, leaving only a little room for the driver to steer clear of it. Despite swerving to avoid it, the driver managed to maintain control of the vehicle and avoided overcorrecting, preventing a spin-out. As a result, the truck sustained only minor damage to its front, and the driver emerged unharmed. This footage was captured at 1.30 in the morning on a Sunday. This video shows dash cam footage of a vehicle moving silently along a national highway. As the vehicle is approaching an intersection, a hooded man can be seen standing in the middle of the street, head bowed. As the vehicle gets closer, the man could be seen attempting to walk in the front of the vehicle, forcing the vehicle's driver to stop and that's when the man's screaming can be heard. He approaches towards the vehicle, which would obviously force the driver to accelerate and leave from that place. That vehicle's driver says that after the encounter, he tried to make a call to warn his wife, who was on the same road one minute behind him. But sadly, he wasn't fast enough, and that would cause his wife to have the same encounter. The couple say that they were not sure if the man was trying to rob them, take their vehicle, or hurt them in some other way. This dash cam video has been captured in Toronto, Canada, in May 2021. The dash cam video captures a car traveling down the road. A plane can be seen flying right in front of it. The plane narrowly avoided the hood of the car as it crash landed across the ground in the tall grass. The plane slides and sustained no damage. There were an instructor and a student inside the plane at the time. They were attempting a touch and go, which is a training maneuver in which you land on the runway, slow down, and then instantly accelerate again for another takeoff. The main purpose of it is to practice numerous takeoffs and landings quickly. This time, the plane was unable to gain enough altitude when they tried to take off again, forcing it to speed across the road into a crash. Fortunately, no one on the ground was hurt, and neither the instructor nor the student suffered any serious injuries. <laughs> 